Today we're going to look at making a basic rainbow in Photoshop. It's really straightforward. First thing you have to do is go to File and create a new document. And for this purpose we're just going to make it 500 pixels by 500 pixels by 72 resolution. Because um, this is just going to be for the web. If it was for print, say, you'd probably want that resolution to be 300. But for now we're going to stick with that and just hit OK. And that gives us a blank uh, canvas to start. And what we can do is just uh, click once on the marquee tool. Because what we want to do is fill, I'm going to you know, draw a rectangle first, and we're going to want to fill that with a rainbow pattern um, that is found under the paint bucket. And since I've already uncovered it, it's showing, but usually you'll find your gradient tool under that paint bucket. So you click on that and hold. And if you, um, like most tools in Photoshop, up top you've got your uh, tool options. So we want to pick out the rainbow color. Um, and there it is at the bottom. Just click once on that. And the next step is to, holding down the shift key on the keyboard, click right next to the edge of your marquee that you've made. And uh, click once and hold. And using that shift key, it's making it a straight line or a 45 degree angle, as you can see. And that works for a lot of tools in Photoshop, by the way. Anyway, um, we've got our shift key held down, we've got a mouse button held down, and we're going to the bottom of that rectangular selection and just let go of the mouse. And you'll see that we've got our beginnings of our rainbow. Um, to get that on its own, layer, um, off the background layer, we're just going to choose Cut from the Edit menu, which effectively erases it and copies it at the same time, and then choose Edit and Paste. With the Move tool, I can move that anywhere I want on the canvas. So our next step is to arch it, and we'll do that simply by with the layer selected, going to Filter, to Distort, and to Polar Coordinates. Now we can see a preview already, and we can zoom out of that preview. If for some reason it's looking not like a rainbow, it's because it needs to be set to Rectangular to Polar. So that looks almost there, so we just hit OK. And uh, at this point, you we want to get rid of that piece there, and an easy way to just sort of fix this is to do a free transform under uh, Edit, Free Transform. Um, or actually, we could just go right to the point, which would be rotating at 180 degrees. There it is. And to get rid of the lower half, we're going to use our marquee again, and just kind of eyeball where that center is select it, making sure we're on layer, uh, the rainbow layer, and with it selected, just hit backspace to delete what's inside of the marquee. Click once outside the marquee to deselect, and we've got the beginnings of a rainbow. And one last option to kind of um, soften that hard edge is go to filter, blur, and you could try blur or blur more. I think I'll try blur more because that's a little more effective. And now that harsh edge is all set. So now you can use this on any document. Just uh, open it up and drag and drop it over. And that's how you make a simple rimpo in Photoshop.